Oh, yeah, something I wanted to ask you. I found this on my way out of Illuria. What do you reckon it is? Hmm. I'd like to know, too. It's an ID card. From a pretty advanced civilization, too, I'd say. What do you mean? Uh, nothing. Don't worry about it. Well, uh, I don't need it for nothing. Here, you take it. Hmm, wonder what it's for. This is Luria? How sad. This used to be such a nice town, too. What about this building? Claude? The pendant! It's lighting up again! You think it's responding to the sorcery globe? We can't waste any more time here. Let's go! ID confirmed. Releasing door lock. We can win this! I hope. We got enemies. Be careful. Be gone. That was a waste of time. This is tough. Don't let your guard down. Wasn't too bad. This looks a little rough. Uh, I'll need to do my best. Nice work! <laughs> this makes Level me up. happy! Ooh, great! 
This is bad. This ought to be a decent fight. Cross slash! Cross slash! Twin thrust! Cross slash! Cross slash! That's it! a little rough. Uh, I'll need to do my best. That was easier than I thought. Here they come. You ready for this? Well, I say awesome. The power. Behind me, everyone. Be careful. What a waste of whatever. I just need a minute to finish this. Don't get in my way. Air slash! Air slash! Nice work! Easy win. This is tough. Be careful. Be gone. Um. Don't get in my way.
creepy! We can win this. I hope. Gross! Ah! Ah! This is it! You, you gotta be hearing things. It's working finally, but why now? What's wrong, Claude? Ah, I, uh... Oh, listen, Reyna, do you mind if I take a look around this floor for a bit? There's something about it that's bothering me. Um, sure, if you want to, Claude. Just remember, we don't have much time. Get in my way. What is this place? Reyna, what is that? Is your pendant lighting up? Huh? No, no, I don't think it's lighting up now. Do you read? Please respond. Uh, uh, my communicator. Ensign Kenny. Service number 00298. This is the Calmness. Coordinates 223-169-33126. Friends Whoa, 10, what? 9, 8, Wait, no, 7, no, I, I can't leave like this! Claude! Stay away! Three, You're gonna two, get caught in it! One, what are you talking three, about, Claude? Claude! What is it? What's going on? I swear. I swear I'll come right back. Come back? Where are you going? Claude! Oh, Claude. I'll wait for you right here. Reyna. Claude! We've been waiting for an hour already. Claude said he'd come back. I need to wait for him. He's going to be here. Reyna. He promised me. Claude! Where have you been? Sorry I made you guys worry. Why did you go off by yourself like that? Why don't you ever pay attention to other people's feelings? I'm sorry. Really, really sorry. Ugh! Forget it! We need to get out of here. Huh? I don't have time to explain. We have to get off this floor as soon as possible. All right, let's go.
Okay, I'm ready. Claude, isn't that your... Yep, my communicator. I don't need it anymore. Reyna? Welcome back, Claude. Thanks, Reyna. Enemies. Let's go, you guys! Twin bunch of fools, aren't you? I didn't think anyone would survive falling off the ship. There's blood on your hands, and it's time to make you pay for it. Oh, really? Well, I'm sorry, but I'm not letting you go any further. This tower is going to be your grave. Oh, it's these guys again. Don't underestimate them. Well, I'd say that's worth 10 out of 10. Hmm. Ah, how did you become this strong? This is bad. This ought to be a decent fight. Let's go, creepy. I just need a minute to finish this. Sorcery globe. Don't move. Stay where you are. Why does this little girl have possession of the quadratic key? 
The only key in existence is the one whose core we created and crystallized. Who are you people anyway? Look out! Uh, 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 Rod. I told you to stay where you are. Hmm. <sighs> You can understand us. Claude, stay with me. That healing power. Are you a Nidian? Nidian? What are you talking about? Who are you? My, my, how uncivilized. People are just as underdeveloped as this planet, flying into a rage at the drop of a hat. No. From what I can tell, this boy is not an Expellion at all. I would say he is probably from Earth. Forgive my rudeness, but what is an Earthling doing so far out on the edge of the universe? I couldn't venture a guess. What are you people talking about? An Earthling? The universe? Claude? Hmm. No, I doubt you would understand any of this. Allow me to explain. That boy next to you is not from Expel at all. He is a native of another planet. Another planet? Yes. The stars up above, those celestial bodies you thought were mere points of light, are home to a wondrous variety of living creatures. Earth and Expel are just two such planets. But that matters not. For we are from Mead, just as you are. I'm from Mead? Just like you? Don't listen to them, Reyna. What are you people here for anyway? Were you the ones that destroyed Illyria? I see no reason to tell you of our plans. What? Besides, you're too late. This planet's already on a collision course with me. Even if we told you everything, you couldn't do a thing to stop us at this point. Collision? What are you doing this for? Are you trying to destroy the whole planet? <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> you inferior beings with your shallow, trivial thoughts. What could destroying a single frontier planet accomplish? This is merely a single step in the road taking us back to need. It is all part of the road map that will bring us back our powers and restore us as rulers of the galaxy. You're taking over the galaxy? Yes. Not that I expect mere insects such as yourselves to comprehend. The time is near. In a matter of minutes, this planet will collide with need. Why? Why did you choose this planet out of all the billions that are out there? This planet was located closest to Need's orbital path. No other reason. Our tool is the Quadratic Sphere, the thing in your world you call the Sorcery Globe. That was what was used to shift the planet's plane of orbit. And that is what will make this planet collide with Need. We had no idea that there was also a quadratic key housed on this planet. Our plans have been accelerated a hundred years thanks to this stroke of luck. What's this quadratic key you're talking about? A crystallized symbological stone. Um, you called it an energy stone. It's hanging off your neck right now. You mean this pendant? But why? It is perfectly reasonable for a Nidian such as yourself to have one of those. 
Only the Nidians have the knowledge required to construct a quadratic key. But enough of this! You'll all be dead in a second. Not if I can help it. I'm going to take out all of you and stop this madness before it gets any worse. I'm sorry to disappoint you, but even if you could beat us, Expel's fate is already set in stone. I don't know that till I try. So you really are that stupid. Hey you, go deal with him for me. You appear to have a death wish, boy. I suppose we could at least grant him the kindness of a quick and relatively painless death. Let me take care of this. I can handle this by myself. I am Metatron of the Ten Wise Men, and fighting me will be the greatest achievement you'll ever have. This looks a little rough. Don't let your guard down. Still stand, I'm done for. No. I'm still stand. You're kidding me. I've turned my back on a billion people and my own son. But this collision is the result of natural causes, as unusual as they may be. I know your own child's involved in this, but I'm afraid there's just nothing to be done about it. This was an unexplored region of space, Admiral. There's no point having regrets about it now. Kurtzman. Claude went down there of his own volition. That's what he wanted from the moment we transported him back here. We all know there was nothing we could do to save the billions of people down there. This planet was doomed to extinction from the start. Damn it! Why does science have to be so useless? Everything is well. We have returned to need. But those little pests have joined us for the ride. We could not have prevented it. They were right there with us. It was our fault for not being able to kill them. Well? You want them dead? It looks like they've landed somewhere far away. 
Leave them. They're helpless at this point. That much is true. Their days are certainly numbered either way. But that Nadian girl bothers me. What was she doing on that planet? I don't know. There was supposed to be no escape route from need. Uh, not in its current state. She's just a girl. A single girl could hardly be called a problem for us. So, everything according to plan, then. Indeed. But we cannot afford to rest easy. Things have yet to even begin. Yes. Rena. Rena. Who is it? Who's calling for me? Rena. Wake up. Raina, you all right? Oh. Claude. Was that you, Claude? Were you calling my name just now? Yeah, that was me. No. No, it, it wasn't you, Claude. Do you have any idea what we're doing here, Claude? I... I don't know. Oh, man. Don't tell me this is heaven or something. No, it's not heaven at all. We're on the planet Need, in a place called the Outer Gardens. This is need? Oh, no! Reyna! Hey, what's wrong? I'm fine. This way. Reyna, what's going on here? I don't know. All I know is we should be going this way. Maybe that's because you're one of those Nidians or whatever. I can't really tell, but there's something about the air. It makes me feel so calm. I feel like all my worries just fly away. Like I've known this place ever since I was young. That's why I think we're on need right now. I seem to remember them saying you were from another planet too, Claude. I... Uh, there was an accident. And somehow I got transported from where I was to expel. And then I ran into Reyna in the sacred forest. And it all went from there. You're still the same. Don't worry about it. This doesn't change anything. Yeah, thanks. We aren't gonna get anything done if we just sit around here. So let's take a look around. How do you think everyone's doing in Expel, by the way? 
Not too well. No doubt about that. Nothing could have survived that collision. Don't worry. I'm sure they're doing just fine. Bet they can't wait for us to get back home, too. Reyna. I'm sure of it. Yeah, she's right. That's why we've got to get moving and figure out what's going on around here. Right. some kind of device. Please, come inside. Who are you? I mean you no harm. Just go on inside the transporter. Everything will be revealed to you. I'm finding it a little hard to trust that myself. I'll need a little more than someone's word for this. Let's try it. Reyna? It's all right. There's something about his voice. I feel like we can trust it. All right. Guess I'm taking him up on the offer then. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. Here goes. Where is this? I don't know. Whoa! Did we mess something up or what? Well, might as well get out. <laughs>